Hello, welcome to how to create a blog using Blogger. This is Mr. Provenzano and I'm here to help you create a blog for your Romeo and Juliet project. Let's get started. First, we need to type in blogger.com. That'll take us to the blogging site. Next, we want to hit get started. Now we're going to create the Google account so that we can create our new blog. You need to type in your student email address. That is your ID number at students.gpschools.org. Again, that's your ID number at students.gpschools.org. I'm going to type in mine right now. gpschools.org. There we go going to retype it in there. Then you have to enter your password. Your password will be yours alone. I will not have access to this password, so please keep it safe and write it down somewhere. Next, your display name. Display name I'm going to use is Mr. Provenzano. I would prefer if you used your first name and last initial. Again, just use your first name and last initial. You do not need email notifications. Next, let's put in the birthday. I was born June 9th, 1979. I am old. And then you have the word verification, which is sometimes very tough to read, so please take your time. And do not get frustrated if you get it wrong. Next, you have the terms of service. If you click on terms of service, you have the blogger terms of service. Read this very carefully to make sure that you follow all the rules that they've established. Once you've finished reading it, click the Acceptance of Terms button and hit Continue. Next, your blog title. You want to create a title that explains clearly what your blog is all about. My blog will be entitled The Epic Romeo and Juliet Project. Now for your blog address, sometimes you try to type in your entire blog title again. So we will do the epic Romeo and Juliet project. And then I check availability. It is available. I have another word verification here. So we're going to type that in. Then we'll hit continue. It says choose a starter template. I'm just going to stick with simple, but there are other ones that you can choose here. Once you've selected your starter template, click continue. Success! The blog has been created. Click on the start blogging now you'll be taken to your blogging template. Every post should have a title. My first post is what I'm going to call this one, and then I'm going to click the box here and type my first post. Hello everyone. This is my first post on my new school blog. Now you can always make the text larger, you can change the font to different types of font. You can bold things, put things in italics, change the color of the text, add links to other sites, change the alignment, add numbers, bullet points. You can add quotes, check your spelling, add images, and add video. These are all things that you can do for your own blog. Also, you can label each post. By labeling the post, it categorizes each post that you've created. So if you're writing about different subjects, if you put the subject down here, that way you can easily sort through all the different posts that you create. So once you have it done, you click Publish Post. Your blog posts published successfully. You click View Post, and there you have it. The Epic Romeo and Juliet Project post, my first post, and now people can leave comments once they've logged in. So this is how to get started on blogging using blogger.com.
you have any questions, please feel free to contact Mr. Provenzano whenever you get a chance. Thank you, and I hope you enjoyed.